The road to state volleyball ending tonight in Iowa. West Burlington taking on Beckman Catholic. First set, Jayana Hilly gets the pass and Brenna Beggs swings out of the middle. She sends that ball almost right into your living room for the kill. A few plays later after the serve, setter Taryn Snodgrass sets up Hilly on the outside, rolling it right over the blockers for the kill to put the Falcons up two. Then it's Hilly passing and the quick set to Beggs. And here comes the boom. You could hear that one. Big time swing from Beggs. Jumping to set point of the third set. Beckman took the first two sets. And then it's Ali Sherbring swinging it into the block. And it bounces out of bounds to end the match. Beckman wins it 3 to nothing, Ending a great season for the Falcons. In Class 1A, Calamus Wheatland taking on Holy Trinity. Starting in the first set, back and forth matchup, Brooklyn Biddle with the kill right there. Later in the first, it's Biddle again, the senior with another powerful kill. Warriors would drop the first set though. In the second set, another tight one, Haley Green. Coming through, up the middle with the kill, Warriors Drop the second set, though. Holy Trinity looking to finish it off in set number three. Olivia Bendlage sealing the deal. Great run comes to an end for the Warriors. Crusaders win it in straight sets. On the road to state in Illinois, Weathersfield hosting Princeville in a regional semifinal. After winning the first set, the Flying Geese looking to close it out in the second. It's Kendall Vincent with the ace. Soon after, Abigail Cabada setting to Legea Angel. Oh my gosh. The senior killing it literally and figuratively. Cabada keeps setting up her teammates. This time it's Emerson Nelson with a kill of her own. Match point now. They go outside to Cameron Anderson for the game winning kill. The Flying Geese soaring into the regional championship, beating Princeville in straight sets. Weathersfield will take on the winner of this one tomorrow. It's Anawan taking on Midland. First set, Anawan's Tessa Grip sets it to Clarabella Van Opdorp, the senior blasting one right off the defense for the kill. That calls for a standing ovation. Later, Grip sets to Tyra Jones this time. Midland going for the dig, but the ball gets away from the Timberwolves for another Anawan point. Bravettes keep killing it from the outside. That's Hannah Heitzler with a kill of her own. And then it's Elon Manuel killing it with authority. Anawan wins it in straight sets. Uh, in three sets, I should say. Other playoff volleyball scores from tonight. It's United over Williamsfield. Stockton beats Pecatonica. Galena rolls past Scales Mound. And Fulton beats Hinkley Big Rock.